What's up guys, this is Captain Explosion back with another video today. Today I'm going to be doing a little Mac tutorial. A special, this is how to record your screen, your Mac screen, plus get your audio and the computer's audio. This, ver this there are other there are other ways that you can do it and some may be easier, but some of them will, um, will require that you pay for special um, for special down uh, stream recording programs, you can't find stream recording programs in the App Store, but the light ones they you can only like record up to 120 seconds, which is um, two minutes, and so you got to buy the full version in order to in order to uh, record as long as you want, and they cost about five bucks, but I'm not I'm not doing that right now. What I am doing is a easier way it does involve one downloading but that's all that's practically all the uh, any other program that you're going to be installing to your computer so what we're, program we're going to be using today is quicktime it's a built-in program by apple that allows you to by itself allows you to to stream record um i'm stream recording right now so, with it but if you use two fingers or if you use two fingers on a trackpad, I'm using a MacBook Pro right now, so I'm using two fingers on the trackpad. Or if you right click on a mouse, you'll get these options here and you and then you can click on new screen recording. Or when it's up, you can come up here to the top left, click file, and then uh, one of these new things. Well, not necessarily new, but when you pull up a screen recording, it will look something like this. You can click this little button here and then you can, if you have any uh, microphones, and if you have any microphones in it, then you can uh, use those for grabbing your sound. Like right now I'm using a USB audio device. Uh, this is for audio recording. Now it, it will, it, it will capture your screen. The, the uh, pixelage is really good. Um, and it, and your, your voice will be included but it will not include any audio in the in uh, on the computer. Like if you're playing if you're playing music music, uh, you won't be able to get any of that unless the microphone can capture some of that sound, and it, and it won't be totally loud, not that clear. So I'm going to be showing you a easy way on how to do that. First, you the program that you will need is called. Uh, Soundflower. I will leave in the, the the link in the description for this. Um, it's uh, what you need. The you want, when you open up the site, you want to come down to downloads and click on Soundflower 2.0 B2.DMG. Uh, let that download, and then once once it downloads, you can check your downloads folder down there or Finder uh, downloads right here. And then you want to uh, follow up the installation process. Now the next thing you need need to do is go to the audio MIDI setup. If it installs correctly, you will see two Soundflower. Uh, you will see two Soundflower options here. The first thing you want to do is come down here to the little plus sign. Click that, and then click the create multi output device. I'm not going to do that because I already have it here. Now what you want to do is it will have all different kinds of audio devices, but you only you only need to include your microphone and the sound flower. You need to include the sound flower. Now once you're once you do that, you are practically done here in the audio MID, MIDI Next, you want to come to Systems Preferences. Go to Sound, go to Output, and then look for the multi-output device that you just um, that you just edited the aggregated the aggregate device. Now, when you when you want uh, create a new screen recording, you want to click on the arrow and look for the one that says Soundflower 2CH. If when you click on that, it will link up with the with the thing, the sound output in your system's pref system preferences, and you will be able to get you will be able to get audio that's coming from your computer. But uh, 
I have not figured this out yet, but um, in order for you to get the microphone along, get your microphone sounds along with your along with the computer sounds i do not know how to do that that's why i'm using an audio recording right now i'm gonna sync this up with my footage with with whatever i got but yeah so that's that's practically it if you want another if you want another version you're gonna probably have to pay a, a, a look around f for a while and try to find a really good version and you may end up having to pay if you really want to but i am telling you this is the easiest way the only hard part would probably, the only hard part would be if you just want to experiment around and try to see, let's see, show audio devices, and try and see if you can get, the, you record your audio while, um, while screen recording. So if you guys want to do that, um, you can go ahead, and if you could, and if you find a way, please let me know, I would really like that, but yeah, so that's how to screen record with computer audio. I am Cat's Explosion. I'll see you guys in the next video.